Hey guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to another video. Today we're talking about delicious, delectable Debbie Denise. So she says that she's famous, y'all, and she has situations. She don't have a such a fuck away like my jazzy life, but that she has situations nonetheless. She wants to put it out here that people talking about her on YouTube is what uh, led to the results of her having to move from the home that she has had for the last 11 months. That's a bold face lie. The company that was funding her stay, which she never bothered to tell anybody because she was busy begging for money to stay in the hotel. But the company ran out of money. So what did she do? Well, she was always planning to do. She moved back to San Antonio. How do I know? Because she posted on Facebook. I did not dox her. I do not know where in the city. That's a very large city. I've been there before. Did uh, some army training there. But she did put out on Facebook that she has, that she actually took all night and moved back there. Now she's still hollering uh, that she has uh, no money, but it was interesting that she got paid Friday, just like I did. So I don't know what the name of the game is, but I do now know why she says she's famous. She says she's famous because, well, she blames it on, or should I say she attributes it to her having 15,000 subs on YouTube, but actually it's because back in 2014, she was in the newspaper, in the newspaper for being in a homeless shelter with her kids, being homeless, um, needing resources from the city to take care of her kids, which part of that was going to a library, allegedly, to apply for jobs that she must never have gotten. Because here we are 10 years later, and she's still homeless. Now, life happens, let's be honest. Uh, but damn, 10 years? Like I said in my last video about this young lady, no child should have to live that way. And as a mother, it's her responsibility to go out and do what she has to do to make sure her kids are taken care of. So why is she not doing it? I don't know. Anyway, guys, tell me what you think, not only about the video, but the fact that she has been uh, lying, scheming, and living off the government for the last 10 years. We know that she had two housing vouchers that she did not keep. Why? Well, we don't know why. We know that's foolish, but we don't know why. And here she is 10 years later, one more kid later, doing the same thing. On top of that, she's not taking very good care of the kids, and you all know why. Go look at my other uh, videos about Denise. Despicable Denise. Dimwitted Denise. Deadbeat Denise. Oh, it's awful. But anyway, guys, tell me what you think about the video, and we will see you in the next one. Let's continue the comments. Or should I say, continue the conversation in the comments. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Dress yourself in one of the expressive t-shirts from Kush Online. Over 109 styles and 18 colors. Kush takes the stress out of getting dressed. Okay, Grandma. Now take us on out of here. Oh my God! You the ugliest bitch I ever seen. Me? Police, come get this man, Becca. Me and you. You just cut my bitch. Damn, Grandma, you gonna get me fired. Dang. Stop what you're doing and go follow Gamble with Mish right now.